So after moisturizing my face, I'm going to be priming my face with the Porefessional Primer from Benefit so we have a nice base to work on. Then I'm applying the Laurel Mercier Silk Cream Foundation. Now if you have really clear and nice skin, you could use a BB cream or just skip this step altogether. Then I'm applying the Fake Up Concealer from Benefit and this is really good for brightening your dark circles which is what I applied it for. Then I'm taking the Fit Me Concealer from Maybelline and putting on any redness or any other blemishes. After blending the concealer in, I'm applying the Too Faced Cream Bronzer to my cheekbones and to my temples to add some color to our face. Then I'm just blending that in with a brush. Then I'm setting all my face makeup so it lasts all day and keeps it matte um, with the KDB powder and I really love this powder and definitely recommend it. Then I'm applying the Bobbi Brown bronzer just to the same place as I did with the cream and just blending that in as well. Then above the bronzer and kind of my cheekbone area I'm applying the Benefit Watts Up highlighter and I really really like this stuff, it really does make a difference. You can't really tell on camera, but when you take pictures, it really does show up. So starting with eyes, I'm applying the NYX eyeshadow base to my eyelids. Then I'm applying Heaven, and these colors are all from the Too Faced Natural Eye Palette. I'm applying Heaven to my brow bone. Then I'm applying the color Nudie, which is a nice matte brown, to my crease area and blending it in. For my eyelid, I'm applying honey pot just to the whole lid and this color is really pretty and I really really like it. it's one of my favorite colors it's like a pretty like shimmery gold then to my outer corner and V area I'm applying sexpresso and this is a really pretty color it adds dimension and smokiness to the look and I really really like it then I'm just blending all those eyeshadows together so there are no harsh lines then for my eyebrows, and my eyebrows are really bad, I need to get them done like immediately, so I'm sorry. But I'm applying Benefit's Brow Powder, and it's in the color medium, just to my eyebrows. Then I'm lining my upper eyelids with the Revlon Color Stay Eyeliner, and this is probably one of the best liquid eyeliners I've tried from the drugstore, so I do highly recommend it. It does last a long time. After curling my eyelashes, I applied the Maybelline Colossal Mascara. I love this mascara for length. Then I'm applying the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara, and I like that mascara for volume. And then I'm applying the Rimmel Soft Coal Eye Pencil to my um, waterline, and then I'm going to set it with a black eyeshadow, and it's from the Naked 2 palette. I forget the name of it, but it's just a black eyeshadow, and this really does help your eyeliner last all day. Then I'm just applying my lower lashes with the Maybelline Colossal. Then to finish off the look, I'm applying MAC Smith Lipstick. You could choose whatever your col favorite color is, but I like this because it's really subtle and I really like it. And then when I'm done with my makeup, I just set it with the e.l.f. setting spray and that is the finished makeup look. Then moving on to hair, I'm going to split my hair in half and I'm just going to brush all the tangles out. Now you can have your hair part in the middle or to the side, whatever you prefer it to. And I'm just applying the Tresemme heat protectant and brushing it in to distribute it. And I'm going to be using the Hot Tools crimper, I've had this thing for years and I put it on the highest setting because I have really thick hair. And I hold each like crimp for like 4 seconds but if you want like a more deeper defined like wave or I don't know what to call it, a wave cramp, whatever. Um, you could just hold it for a 5 to 10, but I like just the loose kind of cramped, especially for the first day of school. I don't want to do anything crazy, but um, that's basically what I am doing.
So then when I'm done with each side, I just hairspray it and I use the Chi hairspray. And then I'm magically done with the other side, so that is the finished hair look. Mm -hmm. 